Hi, I'm Shannon Rollins from Shannon Rollins Real Estate, and we're here today at the historic Red Cliff Plantation. In 1855, James Henry Hammond, a former governor of South Carolina and United States Senator who made the phrase cotton is king popular, purchased property in Beach Island, South Carolina. He named the property Red Cliff for the red bluffs that stood in front of the home. The Greek Revival Mansion was built between 1857 and 1859. It's a two-story mansion with a raised basement, attic, and originally featured a cupola or observatory at the top of the house. The home also features heart pine flooring, sycamore doors and fireplace mantles, and 14 foot high ceilings on the main level. Prior to the Civil War, Redcliffe was a 400 acre country estate with mansion and four slave cabins. The property became home to four generations of the Hammond family from 1859 to 1975, as well as numerous African American families like the Henley family, the Wigfall family, and the DeWalt family. The property was donated in 1973 to the state of South Carolina and is currently one of 47 state parks in the South Carolina State Park System. The grounds are open for free seven days a week from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m with tours given Thursday through Monday at 11, 1, and 3 p.m. for a small fee. The grounds at Redcliffe were designed in the 1860s by landscape architect Lewis Berkman of Fruitlands Nursery, which later became the Augusta National Golf Course. The property's iconic Magnolia LA features 150-year-old magnolias which came from Fruitlands Nursery. I hope you enjoyed the video tour. You really should come check out this beautiful site and keep an eye out for our next historical tour.